this is a recording for Continental Breakfast here. Um, so let's have a look at it in some detail and maybe just try uh, one phrase at a time just to get it really good. Now, if you have a look here at the dots underneath the notes, you'll know that this means to play the notes staccato, which means short and detached. Have a look at the dynamic marking here, and it says MP, medium quiet, okay? Uh, one or two other things to look at, a tenuto sign there, that means play the note for its full length, so sort of with equal force throughout the note, so play it nice and full, that note. And then accent, that means give that note a little push, make it louder than the other notes around it, okay? And then watch for this G sharp, very important, okay? so. The rhythms for the first line here, we've got um, four beats in a bar, and the first two bars are quite easy, so the first two bars just go one, two, three, four, da, 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 do, da. Now I forgot to mention, it's swing feel, so whenever you see any quavers and it's swing feel, you play your quavers Instead of uh, one and two and three and four, do, 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 you make the first one of each pair a little bit longer, like this. Do, 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 scooby, do, be, do, be, do. So when you have this little rhythm here, do, do, da, make it a little bit jazzy, okay? Um, so we're going to try this first line. But just watch this rhythm here. So we've got a quaver there for half a beat and then a dotted crotchet for one and a half beats. So this rhythm's going to go one, two, three, and four. Da, 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 da. Okay. Maybe just try that first of all. So let's try that bar. One, two, three, four. And again. Two, three, four. Okay. Now, let's try the first line slowly. So, MP, so not too loud. One, two, three, four. Now the second line we're going to play a little bit softer, okay? And notice we've got a few slurs on this line. Now, the slurs coupled with the swing rhythm mean that you're going to get a da do a da 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 uh, rhythm for the first two bars. So the first two bars would be one, two, three, four. <laughs> So I'll play that one more time. One, two, three, four. And then that brings us to our low F here. And we've got a tied note. Watch the tied B there, tying over to the bar to the B, and the tied E. So our rhythm here from that F, we're going to go da, 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 do, da, da. And with a crescendo as well, it's going to jump out of the uh, page at you. So it's going to be it's going to be quite an exciting moment. So this uh, phrase will start off from the F. One, two, three, four. So the whole of the second line will go one, two, three, four. Okay, so now the piece has started to get quite lively and we've got to bar nine here and we're playing mezzo forte so it should really sort of start to tick along now. Um, so we've got a rest on beat one, we're going to go two, three, four, one. Da, do, da, da, do, da, 
da 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 do da da ha ha da. Just watch that slur there. So we'll we'll try that bar first of all from the uh, C there. Okay, so try try that a couple of times. See if you can get that. Okay, now. Again, we're still uh, playing some staccato notes, so we're going to start off with a nice short staccato note on the A from bar nine, and we're going to go a one, two, three, four, one. Okay, and that brings us on to bar 13 here. And now we're playing loud so you can really push from your tummies and, and make sure you get lots of sound out of your instrument. And we've got a da, do, da, da, do, da, 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 do, da, do, da. Last line here. This is where it all happens because you're playing fortissimo, so as loud as you can, really, you know, without making the instrument squeak. And then suddenly, after these two bars, you're going to drop down mezzo piano, fairly soft, and then two bars rest, like a little pause, it's going to sound, and then doop, you've just got this little note on its own. So, at the end of the tune, you're going to be going. Da 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 do da da one two three four Okay, so I'm gonna let this play through with the metronome now so you can just hear how all the rhythms go whilst uh, whilst listening to a steady beat along with it okay so have a listen and um, then you can try it but I, I think probably best you know to try maybe one line at a time and really make sure you're getting the rhythms correct okay so here we go <laughs> Okay, and that was with the tempo at 116, so that's quite fast. You might want to play it a little bit slower, so, uh, you know, set your metronome maybe to about sort of 92, maybe a little bit faster, and, and play it at a tempo where you feel confident, and then you can speed it up a bit, okay? Um, good luck to you, and see you soon. Bye-bye.